Welcome to the CTB News Channel. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the hottest news of the day. Our newsletter today includes the following. The president of Saudi club Al Nasser is trying to calm down rumors that Cristiano Ronaldo is about to sign a £173 million a year deal with them. He is labeling accusations from Spain mainly a lie, as Saudi Arabia and Spain continue to pursue Ronaldo. Musli Al Muammar, the president of Al Nasser, has dismissed rumors that Cristiano Ronaldo is close to finalizing his mega transfer to the Saudi club, which would pay him an average of £173 million a year. He stated that the claims that have been made in Spain are mostly a lie. Marca, a Spanish news outlet, has been reporting that Ronaldo is close to finalizing a money spinning move to the Middle East after having his contract with Manchester United terminated last month following his bombshell interview with Piers Morgan, in which he criticized the club and manager Eric Ten Hag. Ronaldo also criticized Eric Ten Hag. CBS Sports also reported on Monday that a medical exam for Cristiano Ronaldo had been scheduled for Al Nasser and that the Saudi club was becoming increasingly confident that he would opt to join them. However, as rumors of a transfer for Ronaldo increased, Al Muammar attempted to address the rumors by describing what has been written in Spain as mainly a fabrication. This came as reports of a move for Ronaldo increased. After Al-2-2 Nasser's tie with Al-Hilal, al Muammar was quoted as saying something along the lines of, reports about, Ronaldo are not right and most of what has been written and stated in the, Spanish, media is a fraud. This was reported by Ebola, if Ronaldo accepts the offer made by al Nasser, he will receive $75 million per year, which is equivalent to £62 million. However, the sum might significantly increase to almost £173 million per year due to image rights and other endorsements. If Ronaldo takes Al Nasser up on their offer, he will not only become the most famous player on the field of play for Saudi Arabian football, but he will also play a significant role off the field of play for the club. If he so desires, he will apparently be offered the opportunity to participate in the selection process for the team's manager. Rudy Garcia, who has previously coached in Europe for Lille, Roma, and Marseille, is presently the manager of Al Nasser. During his stint in Europe, Garcia also managed Marseille. As a result of Ronaldo's falling out of favor at Old Trafford and subsequent departure from the club for the second time, the year 2022 was a challenging one for him. He was only able to score one goal from the penalty spot during the World Cup in Qatar, and as a result, Manager Fernando Santos decided not to play him in Portugal's games against the teams that advanced to the round of 16 and the quarterfinals, Ronaldo left the field in tears after Portugal's loss to Morocco in the quarterfinals of the World Cup, which is likely to have been the last time he competed in the tournament. The next week, he was forced to watch as his long-term adversary Lionel Messi led Argentina to victory in the competition, which they went on to win. Prior to making a decision about his future with a club, Ronaldo has been weighing his choices in order to determine whether or not a European team will make an offer for him. The likelihood of him remaining in Europe, on the other hand, seems to be dwindling with each passing day. And it now appears like he will be relocating to Saudi Arabia rather than remaining in Europe. Share or comment on this story. Thank for watching.